third place finisher Stuart Fries and Stu I'm sure it's not the finish that you wanted but bring us through those last few laps there yeah just uh pretty wild you know the the track seemed like it changed lap to lap one lap I'd feel really gripped up and the next lap I was just skating uh got into some heavy lap traffic and kind of zigged when I should have zagged and um you know Eric and then Matt slid by um uh, but you know all in all a uh, good run for us we made a lot of changes before the feature and the car seemed to really respond well so uh you know thanks to Bicknell Racing Products and um, you know, everyone at Hellmar for all the support and uh, all our great product sponsors, uh, Bart Contracting, all the guys watching at home, um, thank you. And uh, that was a pretty wild race. So, um, you know, it seemed like, you know, Bubba's got a theory here on, on how he does the track and it takes a little bit to run in, but um, you get an exciting race out of it. So we'll, uh, we'll be back again tomorrow and see what, we, see, what, see what we can do. Now, you know, I hear everyone talking about this track saying it's unique. Tell me what you were thinking about this track. I think it's unique for Florida, you know, the shape of it's, you know, very different. Um, but, you know, we, we ran the late model last couple nights at, at, uh, at All Tech in East Bay, and it raced a lot like that. There was they, those tracks, you know, due to the humidity and the cooler temperatures at night, it, it's kind of slimy too. You know, you, you hit a line one lap and you think it's great, and then all of a sudden the front end skates and, and you're on for the ride for the next lap. So um, it, it makes for great racing for the fans, but for the racers, it's kind of frustrating. So we'll, uh, we'll try to just put our heads together with, with our guys. Um, they've been working hard all week and, and see if we can't come up with something that's a little more consistent. If you had to compare this track to any of the tracks that you've ran, what track would you compare it to? Wow, uh, I, I feel like one and two is a lot like Glen Ridge. Um, three and four is a little bit like Woodhall. Uh, and then there's kind of like a dog leg. It, it, it feels similar to the Ridge, you know? You, you gotta be smooth and be kind of fluid with it. But it's, uh, you know, it's definitely unique. All right, Stu, good luck in the rest of the weekend. All right, thank you. You're very welcome, folks. That's Stuart Friesen in the Hellmar, number 44 here tonight at Bubba Raceway Park, finished in third. Again, I wish he finished better. I'm sure he wished he finished better, but third is nothing to uh, complain about.